and welcome back. I'm going to show you guys here an update on the Fire Stick. This is a new one um, and I want to show you guys here how to do it, how to get it, and how to check it. So if you're brand new to the channel, please consider subscribing. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. Here we go. We are on the Fire Stick. And what we want to do is you want to come all the way over here to that little gear icon and come down here to My Fire TV. Now, click on this go to about and then right here so it says an update is available you could also if it doesn't say install update it might say check for update or check update when you click on it it's going to do its thing um, and this will pop up if you do have if you do need one so i'm going to install update now typically with these devices they automatically do them sometimes they do sometimes they don't it says current version fire os is this one last checked was today and looks like we're done i'm going to do it again your fire tv is up to date so yeah it looks it looks like we're good to go so what's new okay so all right we're going to click the back button here and we're going to click the back button one more time and the first thing we're going to do is go over to preferences so here we go preferences and we're gonna go to privacy settings. Now, for some reason, nothing popped up, but there is a, an update that should be here. So I'm just gonna hit the back button once, click it again, it looks like it's still not there. So it looks like there's nothing in effect as of yet. There should be though a new update here. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm actually gonna come here to my fire stick and I'm gonna unplug the power and I'm gonna plug it back in. So, um, Typically what happens is when you do get an update and it has to it goes to sleep mode and it does its thing and when you click on the wake up button on your remote it turns it all on and then you are good to go. Now sometimes it does take a minute, sometimes it is doing its thing which is fine. Um all right, so here we go. We're going to come here to the far right and again going to the gear icon um i'm gonna come here to my fire tv just in case i need to double check on any other updates check for updates and okay looks like we're up to date all right so let's go back and the first update um is going to be the live tv section um it's going to say manage channels now for here in the states there's a lot 379 if you do select it it's gonna tell you where I'm getting my channels from. So 294 is coming from Freebie, Pluto got 51, Peacock 24, News by Fire TV is 20. So it's pretty nice. I can actually move the source, hide the source, whatever I want. If I click on it, it's gonna show me everything that's on here. It's pretty nice and all I have to do is just, I, I could reorder it, I could hide it, I could favorite it, I could do whatever it is that I want. So by by clicking it, you could actually favorite it and unclicking it, you could unfavorite it. So pretty nice and tons of options here what you can get. So that's pretty nice. Everything that you have, you have full control of all of it. Ooh, there's a WB pause and all right, got some cartoon stuff. Cool, so if you do have the new remote with that live TV button and um, we're gonna head and back out of here if I click on that live TV it's gonna send me here to well freebie freebie is, is the main one that's doing it and I could see all the stuff here so it's got a lot of good stuff and this is all free built in within the fire stick um, now there is another option which I know in the UK they did have it and um, here in the States, you don't, it's probably gonna come soon, um, which has to do with your cookies. If you go to preference, privacy settings, it's supposed to come up here. You might wake up to the pop-up, but here in the States, we don't have this pop-up as of yet. Um, so it could be slowly rolling out. Maybe my Fire Stick hasn't reached it yet. I have a couple of them, um, but that's where you're gonna find it. Now, if you are coming back and forth into privacy settings, I've noticed some people say like, hey, the cookie thing is turned, is not there, and they're coming in and out, in and out, and they're like, I see, I don't see it yet. Some people have been able to see it, but, um, that's how that, that's the easiest way that that you can find it now if you don't see it um you know it's probably gonna it's gonna it's probably gonna be off because it needs to allow you for permission um it has to allow consent so 
yeah, just keep an eye out for it. So for now, I'm going to leave it off and maybe it's going to pop up later, but that's how you can get those updates. I do like that managed TV one and how you can see all the live TV stuff and everything that's coming through there. You can manage the channels, add the favorites. Um, you could hide specific stuff, some pretty neat updates there. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Has anybody noticed any anything extra within these updates? It's pretty nice, so pretty simple. And then these updates are very, very tiny. It doesn't take much storage within your device. So yeah, with all that being said, you guys take care, take care of each other. See you guys in the next one.